It's my pleasure now to introduce Kelsey Hatzel, winner of the 2019 Nelson Buck Robinson Science and Technology Award for Renewable Energy. Kelsey, congratulations. Thank you. Now you were selected for this award for your contributions to the fields of solid state batteries and renewable desalinization along with your interest in electrochemical ammonia production. I want you to tell us a little bit about your work. Um, so my, my group primarily works on electrochemical materials uh, and energy storage in particular. Uh, but energy storage is the bottleneck uh, preventing the integration of renewable energy technologies. And so the only way we can get toward a renewable electricity infrastructure is if we can develop low cost energy storage systems. And so that's primarily where my group works in that area. And as far as that goes, how far along are you in, in, in finding that solution? Yeah, so uh, in terms of electrochemical systems, yeah. we're moving rapidly toward electric vehicles, um, but the grid uh, is a little bit farther away just because the cost of electricity is so low and natural gas is so abundant, uh, so it really is a cost issue. Uh, but there's a lot of different breakthroughs happening, so I think that we'll get there. It's an sure. exciting field. It's a very exciting field right now. Now, along with your research accomplishments, you engage in a number of sustainability-related projects. Tell me about your work with middle and high school students. Yeah, so uh, my, my group brings in a lot of um, undergraduates and high schoolers into my group uh, to do research uh, projects. In, in Nashville, we work with the uh, Harpeth School for Girls, which is a local high school, um, and we've had several of their students come in, and they've even had the opportunity to publish as high school students, which I did not do research as a high schooler, so it's an incredible experience. I didn't either, actually. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> So it gets, gets them on the path, the career, a lot sooner than usual. Yeah, it gets them excited about engineering, uh, which is traditionally underrepresented by minority candidates. Um, but yeah, no, it's a great exposure to see the diversity of uh, research that exists. And renewable energy is a pretty exciting topic to work on. And sometimes people don't realize how engineers can contribute to that, to that research area. Exactly, now we were just talking, you've been to Africa several times for a good reason, because you've collaborated with the African Materials Institute to promote renewable energy. Tell me about your work there. Yeah, so there's a National Science Foundation funded program called the Joint US-Africa Materials Institute. And the idea is bringing US and African scholars together um, to attack materials related challenges related to energy. Um, and I attended as a graduate student in 2012 um, in Ethiopia, I attended and gave a seminar last year in Uganda, um, and hopefully I'll be attending next year in Kenya, which is the final of the uh, four series that happened um, throughout Africa. Um, but it really uh, provides ways to network and collaborate um, cross national um, boundaries, um, and specifically focus on materials related challenges. Now, Kelsey, quickly, just tell me where your work goes from here, from this point? Yeah, so uh, we've, we've migrated in the energy storage space to working on solid state batteries, uh, making batteries safer, uh, and specifically as we adopt electric vehicle infrastructure, uh, batteries that can not only go long distances, but are safe and resilient um, is an important challenge. And so uh, right now we're looking at solid state batteries, which are non-flammable, so theoretically very safe. You have a lot of work ahead of you. Yes. Again, congratulations, Kelsey Hassel, winner of the 2019 MRS Nelson Buck Robinson Science and Technology Award. Thank you.